compassion is what we call for today. So we are here tonight putting our faith into action and love. This event is rooted in the heart of a community that cares. Many of you feel like I do standing here today with broken hearts that need to be healed, hoping to find healing. And marches like this, no, movements like this, bring about that healing. And other marches nationwide, actually worldwide, help to bring about that healing. And the healing starts today. Malcolm X once said, if you stick a knife nine inches into my back and you pull it out three inches, that is not progress. Even if you pull it out all the way, that is still not progress. Progress is healing the wound, which requires movements like this. So tonight, we want to nurture those wounds to have healing. We want to have deliberate conversations and actions that will follow. I want to start by thanking everyone involved who came together to make this evening possible. We have all heard of the village concept when it comes to raising children. But let me tell you, that village concept also applies to leaders in the community, diverse leaders who get together to make events like this happen. We are excited that everyone has come together to pull this thing, to put, to put this event into place. So I'd like to give special thanks to our sponsors. As we all know, without our sponsors, we can't have waters and all the other things that we've had today. Fasic Brooks, Leon County Sheriff's Office, FSU <laughs> College of Medicine. All right, I was waiting for it. <laughs> Tallahassee Memorial Healthcare, who provided the hand sanitizer for you all. Sally Cario, Red Eye Coffee, who provided the waters. Impact Apparel, who provided the t-shirts. National Panhellenic Council, are you out there? You are out there. And the Big Bend Minority Chamber, we appreciate all of you. It is said that a strong woman looks a challenge in the eye and gives it a wink. This event would not have happened without my community sisters who stood behind my vision and supported me all the way through. Christy Henry, thank you. Dr. Judy Mandrell, thank you. Dr. Gabrielle Gabrielli, around here somewhere, thank you. LaShawn Gordon, who will meet us at Lake Anita, thank you. And Amber Tynan, who could not be with us tonight. Sincere thanks. I'd also like to thank the FSU College of Medicine students and staff for their efforts. Dr. Joe 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 Jo